Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make whole brown masoor dal and spinach roti, that flat bread. Brown lentil or the whole masoor dal, this is so creamy, made with delicious masala paste and seasoned with ghee, garlic, chili powder, goes well with roti and rice. Spinach roti made with the wheat flour with spinach puree, it's healthy, delicious, very easy to make. Wrap them with your favorite filling and or make uh, kati rolls or vegetable wrap. So let's check out the uh, ingredients, how to make this masur dal and spinach roti. To make whole brown masur dal, wash and rinse for a couple of times in water. Soak for two hours and add to the pressure cooker, add turmeric powder, salt, close the lid and uh, cook for two or three whistles or until they are nice and soft. Allow the pressure to reduce naturally. Open the top and try to mash them roughly or with the potato masher. Now let's prepare a masala paste. Here I have chopped tomatoes, fresh fenugreek leaves. I'm going to heat a pan. I'm going to add a little bit of oil. I'm going to saute this uh, fresh uh, co grated coconut, onion, ginger, garlic, green chilies for one or two minutes. Now I'm going to add uh, chopped uh, fenugreek leaves. Stir till you get nice uh, aroma of methi. And add a tomato. Stir for two minutes. Once the tomato is nice and soft, add uh, garam masala powder, uh, coriander powder, cumin powder and uh, give it a stir. Turn off the flame, allow them to cool and transfer to a chutney grinder. Blend to a smooth paste like this and set aside. Now add this paste to this uh, cooked dal. And mix it well and let it simmer with this uh, paste for five minutes now add little water if the dal is too thick you can always go ahead and add little water this is the right consistency let it simmer for one more minute now let's give a uh, tarka here i have crushed garlic garnish uh, for coriander leaves and cumin seeds and fennel seed here i have ghee and oil once the oil and ghee is nice and hot add crushed garlic let it cook until they're nice and golden now add fennel seed and cumin seed red chili powder pour this tarka over the masur dal and give it a stir This buttery, spicy, brown masur dal is ready to enjoy. You can uh, enjoy with white rice, naan, roti, puris. Just delicious. Serve with more ghee and enjoy. Let's prepare spinach roti. Before uh, puring the spinach leaves, you have to wash this two or three times. Soak in water with the salt and vinegar for 10 minutes. Then rinse them uh, a few times in fresh water. You can chop them or you can hold leaves. You can blanch them and transfer to a chutney grinder. Blend to smooth puree like this. Transfer to a mixing bowl along with the wheat flour. Salt. You have to make nice and soft dough. So I'm going to add some ghee, mix well, knead the dough until soft and smooth, let it rest for 10 minutes. This is almost done and uh, just set aside for 10 minutes. Portion the dough into a small ball and roll the dough neither too thick nor too thin. Heat the tawa or a pan, place the roti on the hot tawa. As soon as the small bubbles appear on the surface, flip it using a spatula and cook the both side gently pressing down with the spatula so the roti puffs well two more and smear ghee over the roti and place them in a box to keep them soft you can enjoy this roti as a wrap wrap them with your favorite fillings or make a kati roll or vegetable wraps you can have with sabzi um, 
delicious i hope you enjoy this recipe guys love you and god bless you don't forget to like share subscribe to my channel ciao